good morning and welcome back to the channel today we're moving on and we're moving back into england we've had two nights at underwood caravan park which is a little cl near bonnybridge and we had a wonderful day yesterday we visited the japanese garden battle of bannockburg and we also went to the kelpies last night to see them lit up so if you haven't seen that video it'll be previous to this one so we're going to move on to Ward's Barnard Castle and we're stopping at a little CS site called the Old Armoury. So we'll see you when we get to the Old Armoury down near Barnard Castle. Bye for now. <laughs> of a mile, arrive at DM12, 9JN, on the left. A bit further away from the road, I think. Do you want to go for that bottom one? Yeah. Out of way as well, aren't we? So 
So here we are, we've arrived at the old armoury caravan site. Lovely manicured uh, grass it has. That's one of his rules. Don't drive on the grass. You can sit on it, you can eat on it, but don't run a vehicle over it. So, uh, yes, it's beautiful. It's work in progress, granted. And it's a camping and caravanning club CS site. They've got five outstanding pitches, perfectly, eh? perfectly level. And uh, slight, as he's just slightly sloping, but nothing major, front, front to back. So we soon level caravan up. So we'll just give a quick look round. And there's not a lot to show you actually. Because like you say, that's, that's a work in progress over there, his shower block and that. So he's using the old uh, bricks from the uh, RAF uh, foundations that were left here or whatever it were. Very nice place. So here we are at the old armoury, which is just off the A66. It's a camping and caravanning club CS site. And it's cost us £20 a night. It's like an old uh, RAF uh, base. And uh, I think this is where they all sort of slept in that. He says where the Elson Point and Grey Waste is, there used to be a little post office. Building in the far corner there's a generator. The middle building is converting into uh, showers and toilets. And you've even he's done a picnic area here. So he's done a lovely picnic area. And you've even got an old air raid shelter. Just here. There's one over there as well by the looks of it. So he's intending to extend through to there as well in the future. He's still developing that area I think. And this is the uh, old air raid shelter. He says this was full of cow muck and all sorts when he first uh, got it. So this is your old air raid shelter. He's still got a little oven on back there. Out in countryside. So, the middle of the site, you've got your chemical uh, disposal point and your wastewater. At the entrance to the site, you've got your fresh water and the gate is locked and you're given a code to uh, open the uh, gate so it's only a chain chain around the gate and i think this used to be the old generator room it's like the bin got your recycling point in here That's it. So he's done a really good job of uh, landscaping, just full of brambles and rubble when he first uh, got it, he says. So it's uh, a good work in progress. Yeah, he's learning new skills every time, he says. He couldn't get hold of a brick layer, so he started doing his own uh, brick laying. So that's going to be a new shower and toilet block there. Done a really good job at dry stone walling though, all the way around. Must admit. So as you can see, it's still work in progress, but he intends to uh, get the shower and toilet facilities done. We've pitched over there. You do get a little bit of road noise from A66, but nothing uh, major. 
all in all that's about it really even said up there used to be uh, stretch all the way up to the top of hill where their masts are up there the camp and everything all this nuts in these fields at back here used to be they were decommissioned after war I think yeah as you can tell he used to be a uh, a greenkeeper on a golf course so you can tell his grass is absolutely perfect right into the side lovely yeah, it's done a fantastic job and it's you know, only going to get better really. It is only going to get better, as time goes on. Yeah, yeah. This is one of the best <laughs> manicured sites I've been on. It's a work in progress. Has been doing it since 2014. Most of it's been done by himself. What a beautiful little site this is, just off A66.